In this episode, we call the same scammers three times over a couple of different days. Uh, you can see when I pulled the fake fire business in the neighbor's house, all the scammer could think of was trying to get the total amount I might have in my savings. In the last episode, the scammer insists he can't see my screen, but when I tell him that I've got it right in front of him, there's no way that he can contradict me, contradict me without giving away the fact that he can't indeed see the screen. So that was kind of fun. Enjoy. Thanks for calling Payable Customer Support. This is Lena. How can I help you today? Yeah, good afternoon. I got a uh, payment confirmation receipt indicating that uh, I had mm -hmm. been resubscribed to Norton and um, I'm unfamiliar with what that is or why I would have been resubscribed to it. All right. Can you please confirm, first of all, what exactly you have received on text message? Um, sure. It's a. Uh, it's got an invoice number, which is XE mm -hmm. uh, four three six five dash seven eight three QL, and then it has uh, the help desk number that I called, and then it says Norton LifeLock three ninety eight ninety nine, along with. Uh, the transaction date and ID, the transaction ID is 4679GX324. And that says down the bottom, All right. please get in touch with our support team right away if you have an authorized Norton LifeLock to debit your bank. And I certainly did not. So I, I don't know what it's about. All right. Uh, check your information to pull up your account information. Can you please confirm me your name so that I can give a look? Uh, sure. Ulysses S. Grant. Uh, Ulysses is spelled U-L-Y-S-S-E-S. -S -S, last name Grant. G-R-A-N-T. Uh, I'm, so much for the information. I'm sorry, could you say that again? I got another phone ringing. All right, thank you so much for the information. Now we are going to block this account, okay? Okay. Hmm. Must have looked me up. <laughs> I uh, will try that again. Thank you for calling customer for the PayPal. How can I help you today? Uh, yeah, I got a. Uh, I was just on the phone with one of your colleagues and. Uh, gave her the information about an email I got. Um, so I don't know if you want to transfer me back to her. or I have this email about Norton LifeLock uh, that I'm completely unfamiliar okay, with. Okay, sir. Uh, do you know her name? No, you know, I didn't catch her name. Okay, sir. So could you please confirm your name, sir? Sure, my name is Ulysses S. Grant. Uh, can you please just spell it out for me? Sure, U-L-Y-S-S-E-S, -S -S, middle initial S, last name Grant, G-R-A-N-T. Okay, so Mr. Grant, just let me check my database, just hold the line, okay? Sure. Okay, thank you for holding the line, Mr. Grant. Mm -hmm. As I can see in my system, uh, this morning, you sent $999 to Mr. John Smith from Western Dayton, Ohio. So did you make this transaction, sir? Well, that's peculiar. The invoice says just $389.99. I don't know who John Smith is or why I would get this okay, email. So I mean, I don't even have a PayPal account, so I'm confused. So you didn't make, 
Okay, sir. So you didn't make this transaction, right? No. Okay, sir. So you want to cancel this transaction? Absolutely. You don't want to pay for it, right? Okay, what? sir. I certainly so, don't want it. No. Okay, sir. So, so uh, to cancel this transaction, you need to connect it with our secure server right now. So could you please confirm me which device you're using right now? So is that your Android or iPhone, sir? Um, I, I, I don't quite understand. I have a, an Alcatel phone. It's one of these things, you know, you, just, get... you flip open and then you, it's, it's got large numbers on it. it. My kids got it for me. It, it helps me uh, read the numbers better. I don't see that well anymore. Okay, sir. Okay, so, so do you have any smart device with you, like computer? Oh yeah, I got a I got a laptop. Like the kids got me the laptop too. It's it works really well. Okay, I like it. Okay, sir. Okay, so uh, do you do you use online banking? Um, yeah, the bank have a special iPad to use for online banking, so I use that. Okay, so use online banking, right? Okay, so sir. Uh, just do one thing. Just uh, be front of your laptop. Sure, I'll I can help do you that. to cancel this transaction. Okay. That would be great. Thank you. Okay, so just be front of your laptop first. Yep, I'm I'm there. Okay, so now just open your uh, Chrome browser. Okay. Yep, I and did. And give a tap in the search. Okay, and give a tap in search bar. Okay. And type it over there, A as in Alpha, N as in Nancy. Okay. Y as in Yankee, D as in Delta. Okay. E as in Echo, S as in Syria, K as in Kilo. You got it? It's an index, right? Got it, yep. Okay, now hit enter or give it a short. Your, your phone line's not very good. Could you repeat that again for me, please? I, I have okay. any now, so, dot com. Is that okay, sorry. Now, do you see download for Windows? Uh, okay, I guess I got to hit enter first. Okay, so yes, I do see download, right. Okay, mm -hmm. give a tap and download. Okay. Okay, now, do you see Windows, Mac, OS, Android, iOS? Do you see that on? Uh, I do, yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, give a tap on window okay. and give a tap on download now. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, I... do you know how to uh, run that application in your laptop? Uh, well, I guess I just double click on the um, icon, right? Okay, yes, yeah, sir. So, okay, once well, the installation is completed, just do let me know, okay? Can you hang on a quick second? I got somebody at the door. Just I'll, I'll, I'll be sure. Sure, sure. Okay, sure. Sure, sure. Mr. Grant.
claro. I'm sorry, I got the, that was the neighbor at the door and uh, apparently the house next okay. door, the house next door is on fire so I'm going to have to wait for the fire department okay. to come so I will, uh, I'll get back to you later if I can. Okay, what happened Mr. Gwen? What do you mean, what happened? Okay, so right now, uh, can you do that? Can you install the, that Anudix? Well, I, I got to go help the, the fire department next door. So I, I, I will call okay. you, I will so call Mr. you Grant, back. I'll call you back later. So Mr. Okay. Sure, Mr. Grant. Yeah. Okay. So, sir, uh, lastly, could you please confirm me what is your last available balance in your bank account before this fraudulent activity? Uh, uh, I, I can't pull it up right now, but if I remember correctly, it was around $250,000. But I'll, I'll call you back a little bit later. Thank you. Yeah, good morning, Christopher. Listen, I was on the phone yesterday at some length with uh, one of your colleagues, and then the neighbor's house caught fire, and we had to abruptly end the conversation. Uh, we were at the point where we had installed uh, AnyDesk on my computer, and he was uh, asking me how much money I had in my account. Uh, it, it involved a refund for a... Uh, uh, something that I had purchased. All right. How may I help you with that? What was the problem that you're facing, sir? Uh, what do you mean, what was the problem? I don't remember. I'd have to go look up the, the email. If you want to hang on a second. Have a look. Yeah, it was, a, sure. yeah, it was a, a bill from from Norton uh, for LifeLock for $398.99. But uh, your colleague said it was like $900, and I, I don't know anything about that. But I don't, I don't want to get more money than I'm entitled to. Okay. So go ahead. Uh, are you in front of your computer right now? I am, yeah. So go ahead and open up your computer, okay. and then open up the AnyDesk application. Okay, it is. Now just hold for a moment. Now help me with the numbers over there that you see on your screen. Yeah, 588,513,343. Okay. So you have to read out the numbers slowly one by one. Five, eight, uh -huh. eight, five, one, uh, three, three, four, uh, three. I, 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 I was talking with Ian's advisor, and you need to hear on accept. Uh, uh, I don't see any place to do that. I can't forget it. Uh, 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 any desk just uh, disappeared. So let me try that again. Um, you need to help me with the numbers one more time, okay? Well, I got to load up AnyDesk again because it just uh, no, right now, it it disappeared. Yeah, I'm going to have to. Oh, my screen got all black here. Let me let me reboot the computer just now. Uh, let's see. Uh, I, I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna have to reboot. I don't know what happened. So anyway, that was uh, quite a fire they had in the neighbors last night. It was really something. Um, so anyway. You still there, Christopher? Yeah, is your computer started? Uh, hang on, I gotta reboot here. Just a second. It won't take yeah, all right, reboot it. Okay. Once it's rebooted, once you're on the AnyDesk, just do let me know. Okay. There's the Windows logo. All right, we're almost there. Let's 
see. Okay, I gotta load up any desk once again. So let's see. Okay, any desk is up and running. Hello? Yeah, hello, sir. Okay. Now, uh, yeah, just open up the... Yeah. Just read out the numbers one more time. Yep, 588-513-343. Again, sir, slowly. 588-513-343. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Now stay on the same page. Now I will be sending you a request. You need to accept that. Okay. What do you see on your screen when you search Now you can go ahead and open up the browser. All right, hang on, let me get rid of any desk here. It's taking up my whole screen. Right. Now, uh, one issue I know this week. Yeah. Gotta make it smaller. So okay, you know. okay, my browser's open. Now what? No, that is the bill. What? What do you see over there? Well, I just opened You have it. to open up the bank page. You have to open up the bank page. Okay. I did. Okay. Right? Right. Just hold on for a moment now. Okay. Now go ahead and log it into your bank, okay? And make sure you do not say anything on this recorded line. Well, you can see my screen, right? No. I don't want to put it. Oh, well, I'll I'll uh, I'll call the bank and ask him for the. In fact, I did that, you know, last night after the fire got put out, and the bank said there had not been any transaction. Um, any three. Well, that has not been reflected yet. That has not been reflected yet. We will go ahead and see what kind of the damages those hackers have done. But you just have to check, not for your banking transactions, not about the recent transactions. You have to go ahead and check if you see any suspicious transaction for a dollar or a cent. Okay. Um, you just have to go ahead and check that. Okay, you do, I'm um, not. I, I don't. Will, we do not want you to. Yeah. I will double check here. Yes, sir. Make sure you do not say anything on this recorded line. Just go ahead, log in. Okay, I'll... Okay. Okay, I'm logging in now. Mm -hmm. Okay, don't see anything. Yeah, I'm looking at my... Looking at it right now, but I don't see anything. On your computer or on your cell phone? On my computer. Okay. So just go ahead and check whether what do you see on your screen, okay? Uh, yeah, I don't see any problems at all on my statement. I see a little green uh, arrow popping all over the screen. It says PayPal mm -hmm. security on it. Exactly. Announcing. That is the security server. Okay, somebody's moving my screen around. Okay. So, do you see anything suspicious? Any suspicious transaction for a dollar or a cent? 
No, anything I, like that? No, I don't see anything. No, no. Okay. So, did you call your bank about this purchase, about this transaction? I did. I called them last night. Yeah, I can call them again today if you want. Mm -hmm. No, that's fine if you do not call your... If you want to call your bank, it's fine. If you do not want to call them, that's fine. But we are just checking what kind of damages those hackers have done onto your account. That's it. Okay. Okay. And so, did you log in into your bank, sir? I did, yeah. I, I can't see anything. So like, did you log in? I did, yeah. And check the last balance? I did. You have to do that again. Please sign out from your computer and then try to log in again. You want me to shut off the computer? No, sign out. You need to log out from your bank and then log in one more time, okay? Okay, I can do that. Okay, so um, I can see here on my system that there have been a transaction of $999 to John Smith. And according to you, you haven't made a, okay, according to you, you haven't made a transaction, right? Okay, I'm okay. logging in now. Just, uh, it has just disappeared. It has I don't know what the problem was. Mm -hmm. Well, I think the, that's the bank on the phone right now. Yeah, the bank is, is calling me. Hang on a second while I talk to the bank here. All right. Yeah, the, the bank said there's a problem with my... Uh, my login, that they, they think there's something screwy going on. What do you want? What do you want yeah. me to do? I don't quite understand here what, what's going on. Mm -hmm. So what do what do I need to do at this point here? You need to go ahead and log in into your bank one more time. Once more? Okay, I can do that. Exactly because you are not logging in into your bank, all right? Yeah, I that was. is the reason. Yeah, I, I did. I did. I logged yeah. into my bank. It was did right you on saw my, anything? It was right on okay. my screen. You were on the web. You were on the website, but you were not into the bank, okay? Well, but but the bank has software so that it suppresses the 
it puts it into a separate screen. You didn't see that. I mean, you can't see my screen. And that's, I mean, that's why you can't see what I'm doing. But it's displaying my statement. I mean, I can tell you exactly what the current balance is. But I, well, it's, it's no wonder you, I mean, you told me you can't see my screen. So of course you can't see what's going on. Hello? Yeah, I'm here. So now uh, just go ahead and log in silently without saying anything on the recorded line. I, I just did. I'm logged in right now. I and mean, now what do you see? I see my current balance and I don't see any other transactions that I haven't made within the last week. Okay, now just hold on for a moment. Okay. I mean, I, you can't see my screen, so obviously... Yeah, I cannot see that, but I want you to check the last balances and I want you to tell me if you see anything suspicious over there, okay, which I you did, haven't made. I just did, and I don't see anything suspicious. It's right, I'm looking at it right now. It's right in front of me. Okay, oh, is it on your computer or is it's it on, on your computer. cell phone? It's on my computer and I, I checked it against my iPad and they agree completely. Both my iPad and... No, you the, have to, you do not have to, you log in on the iPad, you have to use it on the computer. I did. Okay. I'm telling you, I, the, how, you can't see my screen, so of course you don't... No, I can't see the screen. You just told me you can't oh, see I my just, screen. Well, of course. Yeah, I cannot see you. Right. So, I don't know, I don't know why you keep asking me to do it over and over again. Because okay, I, that's fine then. I mean, now it's now it's gone because you closed out the window. But I, if you can't see my screen, I don't know who's manipulating my screen. I see that might be the hackers who might be doing that. Oh well, then we'll, we need to shut off the computer then right away. I mean, I don't want I don't want a bunch of hackers in here. That would be terrible. Mm -hmm. But if you turn off the computer, how will we stop the hackers from doing that? Well, we you, want okay, to do, you, you go ahead, sure. and, go, ahead and, yeah. go ahead and stop the hackers, yeah, yeah. although I don't know how you're going to do it without seeing the screen. Uh -huh. I warn you by your appearance. So I'm saying you that we haven't made a transaction. It is you who made a transaction. Okay. And the reason you can't see the screen is because you have not made a transaction. See, that's, that's the bind they get themselves in. They insist they can't see your screen, and then you can tell them anything you want, and if they contradict you, then you can prove that they can see your screen. So basically, at that point, they're screwed, and there's nothing they can do. And of course, I suppress the whole login thing, so he can't see anything anyway. So anyway, that was kind of fun. We'll call him back here in a little bit, see what's going on.